at any point did you have doubts whether you could come back? Yeah, of course. No, no, it's <laughs> no doubt that, uh, and there's still doubts. But uh, as I say, during all, all my life, doubts are good because doubts uh, make you feel alive. Well, yeah, it's amazing. You know, I, I, I can't be happier you now, and I can't thank enough. This is one of my first trophies, and for me, it's, it's a very special one because I won this trophy with eight years old, and was the Balearic Championship tournament under 12. This corner is the slums, the Grand Slums. Yeah. Normally, I don't go down and stop there and think much about all this stuff, you know, because I, I know I am playing and I am focused on just try to try to keep moving. Uh, but of course, it's a special feeling when I win uh, an important trophy and I'm able to, to bring the trophy back down here in the museum and uh, put the trophy in his new spot. It's, it's a very special moment for me. Rafael Nadal wins in Melbourne at the Australian Open for the first time. Yeah, that's the only Australian Open that I have. <laughs> but I had many more chances that uh, sometimes are lucky, sometimes my mistakes, sometimes opponents play better than me. When they write the story of the great tennis matches ever played, this one has got to be right up the front of the book. Surely Nadal cannot continue. After that, Fabrinka just stands there. It's a victory for Federer. Thanks to our runner-up, Rafael Nadal. Delight for Djokovic as he simply destroys Nadal's dreams. But I'm going to keep fighting to try to add one more. Congratulations, Rafael. We look forward to seeing you someday. Thank you very much, guys. Thank you.